Well, I think you know, in the in the kind of the messiness and the craziness and people, you know, uh, getting in a boat and just going out to get in the middle of a nuclear test, there was a theory of change, mm -hmm. um, and there were a few things happening. So you had great. Uh, you had great communications theorists at the time that realized that the television was the new campfire. That's where all stories and all narratives were starting to be transferred into society instead of around the campfire in the past. And so the original Greenpeace leaders and activists realized that if they could create a really good, powerful story on television, that would create the narratives of the day. So that was the first. And then there was also a, a deep belief in principled, peaceful confrontation where, as we all know, on television, conflict sells. And so as long as you do it with, with principles and peacefully, going out there and putting yourself on the line and then creating that story around the modern campfire, which was the television at the time, uh, was a way to start to really change the way that people thought about our society and about the biggest threats to it. Mm -hmm.